Hello everyone, welcome to Life of Asmi. I am Asmita Masih, a 5th year medical student in Tbilisi, Georgia. In today's video, I will be sharing my shopping experience and some tips that I have picked up over time. Additionally, I will review some clothes that I tried on. If you are here, I hope this video will help you in some way. So please subscribe to my channel and let's begin. I usually buy most of my clothes in India either online or offline. This year I decided to shop offline more than online when it came to clothes. I'm a big shopping enthusiast, so I love trying out clothes before making a purchase. I look for clothes that will last for a very long time and can be worn in different ways. This time around I focused more on buying everyday basics instead of something that i would wear like just twice or once maybe there are certain brands that i prefer with h&m being on top of my list their clothes have super long shelf life and i really love their collection they rarely disappoint h&m basics are the best starting from 399 i love shopping with my mom by the way she always helps me make decision and finalize what looks good and what to purchase so i usually try to just take her with me if you watched my previous vlogs you will know that i have gained quite a lot of weight over vacation so i had to size up for jeans better loose than tight and comfy though let's move on to the reviews this cute tank top was my favorite as soon as i put it on The off-white wide leg jeans also a favorite so I purchased both of them. This dress was so pretty and gave off a fairy tale vibe. However, my mom wanted me to try out more dresses before making a final decision, so I didn't buy it. It has such a soft curl vibe to it though. I loved it. This top was cute. My mom liked it, but I did not. It's not my type. and this one i felt like i wouldn't wear it until i got back in shape so i didn't buy it i love this pullover but i wanted something cropped so my mom found one and i bought that instead i love this halter top i don't usually like halter neck tops but this one was looking so cute on me so we bought it and this one so this is the one that i bought instead the crop one this one was cute too but not my usual style After that we looked around and got a baby pink crop top which I didn't have to try on because I had already purchased it twice before in different colors. They last in a pretty good condition for almost a year and cost just 399. So I always get one in black but this time I went for a baby pink instead. If I had to talk about the quality of all the clothes I tried on in H&M Like I said all of them had such a good quality and lovely material definitely a 10 out of 10 I also got a black cargo from them which I forgot to shoot but I will insert some pictures of it so I always make a list of items I really require and prioritize them starting with the utmost need like jeans and everyday basic tops and a nice pair of shoes planning ahead definitely comes in handy Also at the end of my shopping I came back to H&M to get a nude pair of heels and I will insert the picture of it for you. Once I was done with basics I went around in search of a good dress. On the way I came across a store called Momoso which is quite similar to Miniso. I looked around and definitely squished some plushies. It's exactly like Yoyo So and Mini So. There was definitely something that I needed to purchase that was my makeup sponge, but they did not have a single makeup sponge. They had the ones in the bottles and they I did not need as many sponges as the <laughs> bottle consisted. So I did not purchase that, but everything else was just as cute as other stores too. After that we went into trends but I did not find anything of my liking over there. Following that we went into Zudio and they have such an affordable clothing line to be honest and quite a lot of variety. 
I have always purchased a pajama from here before so I'm going to be doing the same but I also like few dresses that I tried on and I will show you those later the pajama qualities are really good and the dress is also so pretty and just like a minimal everyday summer dress also they have such a good flat collection though i feel like if you are in india and you like wearing flats definitely give it a try this is a dress that i was talking about it's such lightweight comfortable dress and this is the second one that i tried but i did not buy this one cause my mom did not like it but i did buy the black and white one which just costed me 599 and their mist collection and perfume collection is quite nice as well. I bought this mist and it has shimmer in it. You know my love for mist with shimmers in it is huge. Later we got hungry so we went to the food court and this mall they have just renovated it all. And I just loved how pretty the whole food court was. My mom was obsessed because last time when we came here the construction was ongoing. I guess that was last year 2022 around yeah around 2022 august something there are so many food options available here but i went in with my favorite rolls mania chicken kheema roll i absolutely love it and every time whenever i come back home i have to try it at least once after that we went to azorte i love this top but i already felt like i had enough basic tops so i did not buy this one this dress was so pretty but did not fit me that well i tried on the smaller size but no it just felt like not meant for me and then I did try one more dress that is actually my birthday dress so I won't be revealing it. Then we went to west side where I got my shoes from and these are not the ones I got. I will insert a picture of the ones I did. And after that we were in search of good boots but did not find one at all. So I purchased my boots later on with my mom and dad. It was time to go back home and we got KFC parcel and had a tiny dessert while we were leaving. I have already made a Azorte review video so do visit my profile and subscribe to my channel. Plus uh, I love the West Side Shoes collection, it's always the best and I also loved a perfume from there but I did not purchase it that day, I purchased it later on, it smells so so good like I'm obsessed. The funny face for the crunchy balls in the cake which were already soggy. Overall a successful shopping vlog. I hope you liked the video. Please leave a comment down below if you did. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.